by Kathy here from Paint Pourings by Kathleen Miller. I'm going to do a flip cup on a 10 by 10 today. I already did my canvas uh, with my glue. It's a 70-30 mixture and um, I already put my paints in the cup and Phil said to let up on the orange a little bit, but I already did all the, he was watching me do these colors. It's like, duh. Okay, so these are all Amsterdam. And this one is red violet. Uh, this is 24 karat gold by Deco Art. That's the only one that is in Amsterdam. Titanium white, copper, orange, and this is uh, Parisian rose, which is a, a really pretty color. And I did those colors also on this one. So I want to see the difference between this flip cup and that one. So now I'm going the, to do the a larger flip cup. one. The larger one was a squiggle pour. That was a squiggle pour. So I want to see the difference. And this one is going to be my famous flipper dipper. So here we go. So what is everybody doing for um, Halloween? I'm just going to be sitting outside handing out candy. If we have any left, because Phil's been uh, digging into the bag now for three days. I am not a candy eater, so it doesn't matter to me, but he is my sweetaholic here. So, I'm going to let this just flip down. And I know did, I have more paint than what I need, but... Did you want to get a pin and stick a pin in there? Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Stick a pin. That's a great idea, Phil. I've been wanting to do that. Hopefully I don't stick myself. Hopefully this goes through. It should. It might be a little hard, huh? Jeez. This is... Oh. There you go. Yeah, I can't get it. <laughs> oh. You with your bright ideas. Oh, it did sink down. Yeah. Okay. Straight up, huh? Cup art. Cup art. There we go. Gonna have to let that sit and see what happens. Now what I can do is I can swirl in it a little bit. Yeah, try that. Which would be pretty, because ooh, my cells are starting to come up. Yeah. So we'll see what happens. Ooh. I think the orange took over a little bit at the moment. Well, why didn't you say that before I put it in the cup? Well, it's Halloween. You were watching. You know, we can call this the pumpkin patch. The pumpkin patch. Ooh, this cup art is, it's really pretty. Yeah. I need to start a cup art photo thing. Ooh, look at my cells. So now, isn't that strange? Okay. The same paint that I used for the bigger one, no cells. Look at the cells we're getting on this one. I have a feeling it might have been too much paint on the larger one, and they, it just the cells didn't have a chance to come to the surface or develop. That could be. There's so many variables there is. that you have to kind of be cognizant of, be careful. That uh, consistency of the paint, how much paint you're using, the colors, it's crazy. Yes, everybody. The next, uh, when I'm finished with this video, what I'm going to do is, I'm going to mix my pigments like I used to at home. And I just got these in the mail. And these colors are absolutely beautiful. Where did you get those from? Art to art. Art to color, art. Art to art, but it's actually color art. It's called Primary Elements. And it's art 
pigments. They also have the um, ones that you, you can get all over. You can get them at Michael's, you can get them at Hobby Lobby. Um, and these are the Pearlex pigments that you can get. The difference is those are more like crystallized, where this is just like, um, it's, a, it's, it's kind of like either. paprika. It's, it's, oh, I see. That's, it's more of a powdery? Yeah. That's more powdery, uh -huh. okay. Okay, I'm gonna now, tip this a little. Do some tipping, okay. Yeah. Hate to lose those. We won't. Nice cells. You want to stretch them a little. If you watch my videos, whenever we have something with cells, Phil never wants to stretch it because he's so into cells. He hates losing one cell. Well, sometimes it's fine, but sometimes it kind of degrades the, the formation of the cells and the, the look that I like. But everybody has a different taste. That's for sure. Stuff that we like other people might not like. You never know. You, that's why it, you have to make stuff of all different sorts because you never know what someone's going to like. This has got a lot of pretty cells. It does. Okay, now Look at the gold that turned into green. I know. I was just going to mention that. Did you notice that? that? Because you did not use any green paint whatsoever. Mm -mm. And the gold picked up a greenish tint, tint to it. And I'm not sure quite where that came from. Unless it was the Well. Mm -hmm. I, don't, I don't think the pink would turn. A greenish tint with the gold. I gotta get this off the side, otherwise it's not gonna. Yeah. It's gonna keep being green. This is actually really pretty. It's just so weird. I think it's so weird how it went from all these cells to no cells on the other one. It's really strange. This kind of looks like, like a duck's beak, <laughs> doesn't it? Yeah. yeah, I think the other one had too much paint. That This reminds me right here of an acorn. Yeah, sort of. Mm -hmm. Slower, otherwise you make everybody dizzy. Okay, everybody, I hope you have a happy Halloween and um, subscribe to my channel. Press the bell if you want to see my videos and um, share it if you'd like. And until the next time, bye.